Good morning cultists, welcome back to another Undaunted Breakfast with Kuta Loops. In the last episode, we spent the entire time talking to basically everyone and their dog in Meridian. Um, we have a new quest, it's from the Hunting Lodge to get a Stormbird and Thunderjaw trophy. After, if we can actually get these two within this episode, we'll, um, and we have some time left over, we can go to Collateral or do the quest collateral, which is to find uh, Olin's family and whatnot. All right, well, let's do the Stormbird fight. Um, as some of you may know, I am not a big fan of, uh, fan of fighting Stormbirds because at a certain point, the fight just becomes a bit of a dredge where you're basically just, I don't know, <laughs> trying to outlast them. So, uh, or, I mean, not really, I guess, but you know what I mean, maybe. All right, let's do this, punk. Be fascinating if they Did I actually get its attention? Oh, wow. Am I actually hurting it? Oh, crap. Okay. <laughs> nice. Oh, shoot. Holy crap. I, maybe I should have gotten um, some more stuff before we started this fight because I think I'm woefully ill-prepared for this Royal Rumble that is now taking place all up in my butthole and if there's one place I don't want a Royal Rumble to take place it is in said butthole now if I could please get your information before we where the hell that's partly why I don't like fighting the Stormbird. Most, well, because near the end of the fight with a Stormbird, it just basically becomes a real dredge. Where you're trying to just... Are you kidding me right now? Where well, you're trying to just take the thing down, and all it really wants to do is just fly around and not do anything. So, yeah. And uh, also, targeting this thing is a nightmare. Absolute nightmare. Mostly because I suck at um, targeting, aiming with, with a console, uh, or a controller rather. This is why I don't play FPS games on uh, the console. Or in general, I guess. Ah, crap. Okay, um, I think it actually does have some chill water canisters on its back part. Or no, is that Blaze? That might be Blaze, as a matter of fact. Okay. Yep, I think that's Blaze. Those are Blaze canisters. Yeah, that's on fire. For sure. Okay. Uh, there's another one over on this side, although I don't think I can target it from this angle, unfortunately. So if you could please stop fucking flying and... Oh no, I almost had it. Almost had it. Okay, wait. But it is shooting, um, chill water stuff at me, is it not? It's gotta be. Alright. I think, no, I don't think I got it. Or did I? No, I don't think I did, unfortunately. Crap all over it. Basically using up all my healing potions here. What the hell? Who was that? Who made that noise? <laughs> is there a random Royal Rumble happening behind me? Alright. Now is my chance. Oh, you dick nugget. Fuck, stop moving your fucking crap around, you ass bag. What are you doing, Aloy? Or, I guess, you know, that works too, I suppose. I didn't actually intend to do that. That was a complete and utter mistake, but... It seems to have worked out a little bit, somewhat. Although, not by much, I will say. Now, you kind of need to fucking move so that I can target your blaze canister. Expose your weaknesses to me, good sir. Did I get it? I think I got it. Please tell me I got it. Yep, I got it. Fantastic. Right now, now that son of a bitch is on fire, um, which... Isn't really helping us too much, though. But they still need to take out its wing stuff. 
Unfortunately, that's gonna take 50 million years and a half. Good grief. All right, so what else are its weaknesses? Am I swimming right now? Can I not be swimming, please? Aloy, I mean, it's a good way to get out of the fire, but let's face it, it's not really pertinent right now. Okay, I don't think I'm actually doing much against it. Right, I finally gotten the component removed, and it is still firing its... It's not chill water, is it? You know what? Let me <laughs> take a brief pause, and we're going to use the Tear Blaster thing that we got in our last episode. Um, so let me switch out the... Hmm, Shadow Warbow. Yeah, and then we'll get the Tear Blaster instead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, um, let me equip the Lodge Robe Caster, because I think that's much better than um, what we already have, which is the regular old Robe Caster. Alright, you son of a bitch. Oh my god. How many fucking things of this is this gonna take? There he goes. Fantastic. Now, let me switch over the to the Terror Blaster. What? Oh shit! Does it actually- it does have Chill Blast canisters! Never mind! Ah, crap all over it! It's too weak. Okay, sweet. What the hell? What am I firing exactly? Oh shit, burglar. Okay. Okay. Alright, it's got some Sonic Jet crap. All right, we are tearing asunder its butthole. I hate that attack. It's so ambiguous. It's like it doesn't really have a distinct um, range or anything like that, yet it somehow does a crap ton of damage. All right, you son of a bitch. All right, that didn't really help. I feel like maybe we've hit the range limit of this uh, Tear Blaster thing. It's pretty cool. I'd like to experiment with it more, but for now anyways, there's not much we can really do with it. It's limited range. Fuck. Me. Alright. Uh, did I? Okay, it's... Alright. Actually, let me switch this over again. Because I want to get the... Wait a minute, does that mean... Ah, oh, crap, okay, sorry guys, I'm gonna need to switch back to our war bow instead. You know what? I'm going to try to tie this bitch down. There we go. Okay, so I think it requires three, four, four. Okay, so now we're gonna use the... Chill Blast Arrows 2. There we go. Hey, we got the, uh... We got the thing now. Fantastic. Right, you son of a bitch. Crap all over my dirty, dirty ball sack. Okay. Oh, what the hell? It's still got some kind of, like, attack? All right. What is it doing exactly? I can't say I truly understand what's going on there. All right, just one more hit. And there he goes. Into the drink. Well, got to say this isn't exactly how I imagined this um fight going, but fair enough. It actually wasn't that bad this time. Um stealth weave, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Stormbird Trophy, fantastic. Because my biggest gripe with the Stormbird fights is that it just devolves into complete inaction near the end. But I think we kind of avoided that by not tearing apart all of its uh, components and whatnot. Or at least that's my interpretation anyways. Echo Shell, which is definitely useful for our um, production of Terror Blast stuff. And I guess we have too much chill water? Sure, we'll load up on the echo shell though, because I don't think we have a full thing of that. 
Shock Wax Root, sure, I guess. And more Echo Shell. And definitely more Ridgewood, because I am just sorely lacking in Ridgewood. Which, let's face it, no one could have predicted. Take that Metal Shard, too. Um, and then... I'm just kind of trying to collect some medicinal herbs. Because we're going to go fight a Thunderjaw, which, let's face it, is going to be much harder than the uh, tussle that I just had with the, um, that guy. With the Stormbird. What the hell happened here? Oh, I guess some bandits decided to get completely ass-blasted by, um, by some things. Yeah, I saw a rabbit. Okay, it's gone off way over that way. Whoa. What happened to this corpse? And supply crate. Oh, Ridgewood. Fantastic. Health potion. Nice. Can I perhaps get this one underneath the lean-to? Nice. No space. Yep. Don't need that chill wa water. Thank you very much. Health potion. Very nice. Alright, let's save. And I think we're going to probably fast travel over to the... Um, Thunderjaw? Actually might not that not might might not be that far, but I'm probably gonna fast travel anyways. Actually, you know what? Let me put a cut in here and then I'm actually going to um, manually go over to the Thunderjaw because I want to collect medicinal herbs along the way, and I don't think I can Yeah, it's probably safer to do it here. Alright, so I'll see you guys in a sec. Alright, we're back. Ah, uh, okay, so um in between, or during the break rather, I have gathered all the stuff, as in I've gathered all the herbal medicine, I've gathered a lot of Ridgewood, and I've also managed to craft a whole bunch of stuff. So I guess we're now ready to Royal Rumble with the uh, big old fucking Thunderjaw. Actually, do we? Okay, Tramplers, fellow Fire Bellabacks, and Rock Breakers. So there's nothing I can really do in regards to um, tutorial stuff for the Thunderjaw that's remaining. If that makes any sense. Alright, well, it doesn't appear to have noticed me. I mean, it's noticed me now, but just a second ago it didn't notice me. And it's coming in. It's coming in hot. It's coming in heavy. And it is time to rumble. Okay, let's get rid of its other gun. Oh, jeez. We may want to possibly find a better place to fight this thing. Oh, shoot. Okay. I forgot it has some massive, massive guns. Um, I think... Are some of its weapons... What the shoot? What is... What the shoot? What does that mean? I don't understand, but anyways. I think we can probably take that thing down as well. Uh-oh. Yeah. So far, we haven't done much damage to it, but I'm hoping that'll change soon enough. Alright, so I should probably do another scan on it. And it's got one of those weapons on its top side, I think. We may want to possibly, maybe, I don't know, just use our uh, potions and whatnot. Okay, I've managed to take this casing off its head, I think? And I think its uh, tail is also a weak spot, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, okay. Oh, what is that fire? Alright. It's good. I think I'm starting to strip it of its armor somewhat. Damn it! Okay. I don't think the um, Terror Blast arrow to its face is working quite the way that I'm expecting it to. Alright, um... So what does it have? Freeze canisters. It also has... Damn it, you fucking... Rock piece of crap. Okay, um... For some reason, though, it seems to be content to just... Attack me from afar. Using whatever it's doing right now. Which, let's face it, is actually doing a fair bit of damage to me right now. Okay. Okay. Its range is pretty crazy. Can I perhaps get the tail ripped off? Ah. Oh, fuck. That's 
so annoying. All right, you know what? Let's rope cast this bitch. Alright. We're doing it, punk. You know what? It's actually easier to dodge that thing when we're close, I think. Let me also quickly switch over to... Uh, I think the Warbow might be a little easier for us. Yeah. There we go. Instead of the Rattler. So that way, at least, we can use the, these arrows and whatnot to target the... Come on! The giant Nutsack. Okay, I'm hoping that'll do a decent amount of damage to me, apparently. Unbelievable. Okay. You filthy scum. You filthy heathen. Okay, I think we got another few of its canisters locked in. Great. Oh, shit. Oh, it's Grundle. I think I got its Grundle. Somewhat. Yep, yep. Definitely getting more of its Grundle. And it's just buggering off now. Um, has it lost track of me? No, it did for a second, but not anymore. Uh-oh. Is it coming in hot? Is it coming in heavy? Uh, kind of. But not exactly the way that I'm thinking. Come on. Come on. Oh. I hate aiming with controllers so much. So very, very much. Oh my god! Alright, that was terrible. More like terrifying than terrible, but anyways. Okay. Oh yes! Oh no. Um, who died? <laughs> oh shit, I think it actually just randomly killed some Karja dudes. Which is pretty hilarious, I gotta say. Okay, yep, it definitely just randomly killed some uh, Karja dudes in the back. Stop moving! Flush them out. Come on, what do you mean flush them out? There's only one enemy, and it's that thing. Okay, so I think we're doing a fair bit of damage by shooting off its uh, freeze canisters. My god. Holy crap, holy. Okay. It's Grundle I can't see because of the fucking Karja guy. Ah, oh, shit. I don't think I got it. Ah, oh, crap all over my nuts. Holy shit. I... Listen, I only have so many fucking bones to break. Alright? Take it easy. Right, this might make things a little easier to target. Somehow I managed to hit it through its jaws? That was terrible. That was a, a very bad decision on my part. Alright, we're gonna need to start using our um, full health stocks. Oh no! It is actually out of um, the fucking... Uh, uh, what's it? Thing. We got it. We got it. We're good. We're good. The sun never fails. Well, except for this guy. The sun failed him, that's for sure. Oh, okay. Well, that wasn't that bad. I say that, but of course, the uh, swearing was rather intense. Um, <laughs> for which I apologize. Okay, we need to deliver the trophies to a cease. The, sorry, ass face, my bad. Um, can I? Oh no, that's Rodney. He's dead. Yeah, that's fair enough. Well, we can always bring back another Rodney, so we're okay. Um, can I try to find some of it? its other components? Where did I start this Royal Rumble? I think I started it pretty far away from here. So we might need to... Oh no, I think it actually started uh, over here. Yeah, that's why you've got the disc launcher and all that enough. stuff. Right, right. 
Man, this fight would have been so much easier had I actually picked up the disc launcher that it dropped. I didn't realize that it actually dropped it in the first, um, the first, uh, Terror Blast arrow. But yeah, it definitely... So wait, are the things on the sides the disc launcher? Or the thing on its back? Or the things by the sides of its face? I have no idea. But we're going to head over to Collateral, which is the quest to find Olin's family. Thank you for coming back from the dead, Rodney. It's very, very grateful for your appearance. Um, but if we can perhaps collect some more... I don't need Fire Kill Mood. I was gonna say, if we could collect some more Ridgewood as well as... Medicinal stuff along the way. That'd be fantastic. And there's some medicinal. S That's fire kiln root. What did I just say about not needing fire kiln root? Thank you. All right. I should probably craft some of our ammo back though. Uh, hard point, sure. Terra blast, definitely. It's one of my favorite arrows to use. And freeze arrows came in very handy for that fight. And I think we might need to also rope cast. Yes. I think that's about... Yep. That's all we used. Rope cast, tear blast, and freeze. Which I'd say is a decent assortment of uh, stuff to use against one of those big boys. But it's all good. Okay, Rodney. Take it easy. No need to freak the fuck out. Don't get any ideas, stranger. I, I, well, I, are you kidding me? What do you mean don't get any ideas? What an asshole. Hey, this outpost, this outlaw outpost that you're standing in, I liberated it all by myself. All right? Save these for the trail. Don't stupidly freaking say that I don't I shouldn't get any ideas. These ideas gave you this base. So, what do you think about that? Got any ideas about that, you punk? What a jerk. All right, anyways. <laughs> Crazy ranting aside. Um, I'm not quite sure how long this mission is going to take. So we might not be able to get it done this episode. But I think at least we can get it started. Ah. Snap moss. Took them on enough. Hey, watcher's dead. That's right, punk ass. Is someone attacking me? Can they not attack me, please? What the hell, snap mom? You don't see me coming into your house and then just completely tearing your butthole asunder, do you? Or rather, I guess that's exactly what we do, but anyways. Get out of here, buddy. That's right, punk. Stupid charger. You ain't got no chance, buddy. No chance. What is making all that rumble? Okay, I do have a quest to fight one of these guys, I think. Tramplers? And rock breakers. Freeze robots weak to freeze damage. Oh, I see. Alright, then let me quickly equip the rattler. There we go. And use some freeze damage on it. Um, actually, before I do, can I perhaps equip the rattler with some freeze damage stuff? Nope, I cannot. Or at least none that's worth having anyways. Alright. Let's tussle with these bad boys. Oh. That's right, punk ass. Frozen. As in, we're making these things watch the um, uh, children's animated uh, cartoon uh, Frozen. Oh no. I saw that coming a mile off. All right, fantastic. We got the Shadow Rattler quest done, and Rodney has turned against me. Rodney is sick of my shit and has decided to just completely try to annihilate my existence. Nice. Thanks, Rodney. Thanks. Hey, we've leveled up. Nice. Okay, um, can you not do that, please? Also, can I zap your back? Guys, if I could possibly just zap your back, that'd be great. Now's my chance. Oh no. 
I think we're in for it soon, guys. Yep, we may be in for it. We might need to just bugger off. I don't know if we can actually tussle with these dudes. Alright, peace out, home slice. Actually, it just exposed its back to me. Oh, what the hell? Does it not do the thing that it does with the uh, Warbo? What a piece of ass. What an unbelievable piece of ass. What a crap NATO. Oh no. They are not happy. Okay. Perhaps if we can quickly. Oh, come on, man. Oh, are you kidding me? Fucking bullshit. Come back, you bitch. After all that, only to end up with nothing. Is this guy blind? Apparently so. Oh no, they've come back. Well, I didn't want you guys to come back. You know, I was done. I didn't mean it. Oh, what the hell? He's got some weird fucking line attack. Okay, so I think that might trigger the great explosion of 2018. Alright, that's gonna be another explosion. Super fantastic. And now... That's right, punk ass. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. I'm being completely annihilated. From the heavens, or something. I actually don't know what's uh, hitting me. I don't think I can actually um, hit his back from here for whatever reason. Okay, just another um, uh, rumbler or whatever the hell they're called. Oh wow, I actually managed to knock it down by completely annihilate, annihilating its uh, horn. Okay, I can't see you. Oh shoot, what the hell? That traveled through the sky, that was hilarious. Oh no, oh no, that's less hilarious. Oh wow, you know what? It's down. This is hilarious. Ah uh, shit, I could have overridden it. Damn it, that's okay though. And I can't pick up the trampler heart. Fair enough, I don't know if I necessarily need a trampler heart. Would have been nice to get, but oh well, that's okay. Um, and what am I lacking right now besides a whole bunch of shit? Oh right, we used a lot of the shock arrows. Get that. We'll get the. I guess that's it, right? Oh no, I actually used up some of the. Um, whatchamacallit? The ammo for. What the fuck am I doing? There we go. The rattler stuff. So let's go stock up on this. Which uses a fair bit of uh, ridge wood. Now I think we want to get Tinker. So let's go with Disarm Trap and then. Um, Next time we get three skill points, we should be able to uh, pick up Tinker, which will make uh, the shuffling around oh, of ready. our... <sighs> the shuffling around of our um, stuff a little easier, if that makes any sense. Oh, Grazer Heart, thanks. That's super useful. Uh, what was I going to say? The shuffling around of our what? Fuck it. Never mind. I actually don't want. Oh, I don't know what I'm trying to say here. Disassemble multiple. Just disassemble all of this, please. Thank you. And medium machine core, which we can sell for a decent amount of money, and get some more metal shards. And you know what? I don't think we're actually gonna reach the um, quest with the amount of time that we have. So let me just quickly look at the hearts that we have. I don't think I have a trampler heart, unfortunately. Do I? No, I have like 50 million Watcher Hearts though, which I definitely don't need, which I'm gonna just break down. That way I'll have space for a Trampler Heart. Yeah. Alright, well, um... Maybe... Maybe we'll actually have just enough time to get to the quest, but not actually start it. Because I don't think I'm quite ready to um, commit to starting a quest just yet just in case it takes like 50 million years. 
And we have apparently discovered a Glint Hawk machine site. Which I'm not interested in, I'm not gonna lie. I don't like fighting these guys because they're the flying dudes and uh, flying dudes annoy the ever-loving crap out of me. Wouldn't you agree, Glint Hawks? Wouldn't you agree that you guys are annoying as all fuck? That's right, even they seem to agree. Which is why um, we're just buggering off from them. And also collecting some medicinal st stuff along the way. And now I'm being attacked by everyone and their dog. Great. Wait, where am I supposed to go? I'm going here. Why am I being directed to somewhere else? Just Spur stay out of the way for now. All right, fine. You know what? I'm actually gonna travel over there now so that we can start our next episode right at the start of the uh, mission. So we don't waste our time traveling and weaving and ducking and dodging through various um, beasts that are trying to, to your completely end my existence. What is behind me? Another beastie that is wanting to end my existence? Quite possibly. Is it? Oh, yeah, definitely. The Tramplers, they definitely want to see my uh, life be snuffed out. But we only need to go over there. Thankfully, these guys are pretty preoccupied with grazing on grass or whatever the hell it is that they're doing. Oh, I need to talk to Olin and explore the spur flints. Okay, well, I'll do that. But I think... Yeah, let's end the episode off here for now. We'll come back tomorrow and then we'll talk to Olin and then explore the Splurf of Flints or whatever the hell this place is. Yeah. Alright, so for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast.